It's nose horn viper. Oh wow! <laughs> and a big one. Wow. When are you dead? When I saw it. I hope it's alive. It's yes, alive, it's yes. alive. Whew, I was not sure Whew. because it was not moving at wow. all. And there was a car a few, few minutes ago. Wow. Oh, yeah. Big she snake. She bit himself. Wow. Amazing. Should I bring a, a yeah, hook? Yeah, hook, hook, bring the hook and help me. Because uh, if it goes to the vegetation, I can lose it. Mm -hmm. Ooh, she's angry. Yeah, yeah. I can imagine. It was nicely getting some warm Ooh, feelings from the from the road. Okay. Is it okay? Mm. No? Mm -hmm. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Oh, it should be safe, I think. Perfect. Mm -hmm. Wow, awesome. Oh. Wow, it's a big individual. Oh yeah, it is. Really big one. Wow. So we slowly and carefully start to work with the snake. Um, after some time, snakes see that you are not a threat, that nothing bad happens to them, and they nicely calm down, and then we can get uh, really nice footage, even of their natural behavior. So um, it's also good to pick the spot carefully, where you will work with the snake because uh, it's now 7 a.m. but it's already hot on the sun during the summer some snakes might even be active uh, during the night like this nose horn viper and if we started to work with the snake on the sun it would overheat very quickly and it can be really dangerous for the snake and of course they want to get some natural behavior. So here in the shade we should be fine and we will have enough time to get some footage and photos. And it's also a nice place. So this is the kind of behavior I was talking about. If you let the snake to move freely for a while, it starts to show you the natural behavior. And now the snake really looks like it went to rest or bask on the branch where it is nicely camouflaged. We saved the exact GPS point where we found the snake and now we are heading to another location and we are stopping here and we are going to release the snake. Uh, it's hot again during the day so we will find a nice spot in the shade so the snake can hide and survive the day and start to be active again during the night I guess. So come to see the snake as it goes out of the bed. Oh wow, that's amazing. Nicely naturally. <laughs> Usually when we release snakes back, we have a feeling like they, they know that they are back at the familiar place. It looks like they, they are just at home. You can just see it on them. Amazing.
Wow. So cool. Beautiful snake. Mm -hmm. and amazing to see it going back. And we were really lucky to find it during the summer here. Yeah. And it's going under this rock. We have a viper, oh. maybe. Our first viper. Oh yeah, cool, cool. Active after the darkness. Uh -huh, thank you. No, 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 you never think. Perfect. Mm -hmm. Wow. Nice. Better you hold it. <laughs> yeah, it's fast. <laughs> And it has a nice reddish one. tail. This is a nice male, I would say. Probably, yeah. Wow. Very nice one. Mm -hmm. Beautiful. I will try to open the back. Uh -huh. Yeah, it's open enough. Uh -huh. Perfect. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. <laughs> yes, it's there. Perfect. <laughs> catch it, catch it with them. <laughs> I see another nosehorn viper. Where is it? It's there, lying. Oh yeah, I can see it. Just lying there. Okay, just lying. And it's a baby, it's tiny. Yeah, it's quite small. <laughs> wow. Ay, ay, ay. Oh. Hmm. Yeah. This one <laughs> is trying to escape. Hook. Okay. Yeah, thank oh, you. Poo -poo. Poo -poo a little bit, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, these small tiny vipers are a bit difficult. With vipers, the filming is really pleasant and even easy with the small species after they calm down and they stay on one place you can really enjoy observing these animals and film some detailed shots this one is really cooperating now so we spent about 10-15 minutes with the snake basically at the spot where we found it we filmed some uh, details, some uh, moving shots. The interesting thing about this individual is that it doesn't have any pattern on the head. So uh, we wanted to uh, document that. And now we will basically let the snake uh, go back to its spot and it's almost there. Okay. So you were right here in this place so you can go back there mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Nice. Wow. there's a hole or something you can hide there oh cool we are now working with the um, nose hunt viper from last night uh, it looks very similar like the individual we found half an hour ago but there are some differences between uh, both of them uh, especially on the head and maybe even the size is a little bit different back at the same spot of this guy and I'm going to release him Okay. Uh huh. He's there. <laughs> oh, a little surprising <laughs> that was, for him. That was nice. <laughs> he almost looks like in the same position when we found him. <laughs> yeah. The only difference was, was that it was during the night. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Very nice. <laughs> I'm no, he's moving. Oh, he's moving. Okay, bye. Oh, and it's gone. <laughs> <laughs> it was quick. I see a viper. Maki is coming. It's on the 
bush, um, like in maybe 40 centimeters up, under this big branch, big tree. Where you can it? see it uh, there, sitting on those branches. Like no. it's like 40 centimeters. Oh, I see it. Oh, wow. And wow. yeah, it's just there. <laughs> Beautifully cool. above uh, the ground. And we are approaching really slowly. Yeah. I think Beautiful now you can, individual. you can see it. Uh -huh. It's just there, Wow. chilling on the branch. Beautiful. <laughs> Can you hold it for a second? Yes. And, we'll take out, take out the sun. and it's not on the sun. I expected no, them uh, to be on the sun now, mm -hmm. basking before the darkness. But nope. In the shade. Interesting. Hidden it's just wow. sitting like this. It's very cool. Wow. Yeah. Really, really cool. And it's like velvety. Uh huh. <laughs> it is beautiful. Always amazing to see snakes in situ like this. It is. Really weird to have so much time to think about the catch of the snake actually. It's not usually like this. <laughs> you are holding the bag. I know, I know. I know, perfectly. Okay. Oh, okay, I will go from the other side. Here. You can hear, perfect. Uh -huh. Perfect, it can't escape here, which is great. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Reddish tail again. Hold on, hold on. I'm trying. Mm -hmm. To help myself with the with the hook a little bit. Okay. Uh -huh. Take this. Yes. I will just put it with this. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes, perfect. Perfect. Now we are filming the third nose horn viper, the one which we found in situ on the bush, which was really amazing, stunning coloration of this species. Very, very cool. We just finished uh, filming of this beautiful northern viper. Uh, we are filming it very close, just maybe 20 meters, 30 meters from here. And as you can recognize, this is the spot where I uh, found it. And we will release it directly here on the same spot. Hello. Take your favorite bush. I'm curious where where is she heading or he? I'm not sure.
Nice. Wow. Interesting place. Yes. <laughs> Thank you for watching our video. If you liked it, don't forget to subscribe and hit the notifications bell. Or if you want to support us more, you can even become a member of our YouTube channel. You can also buy our merchandise. Uh, the link to our store is under the video in the description. Thank you.